Oh my god. Are any of you afraid of snakes? You're not gonna like this. A snake is inside of my house, on my kitchen counter. I don't know how it got there, but there it is. I, uh, I'm not afraid of it, but I don't really want it just kind of hanging around the house surprising me at any moment either. I'm gonna like block off my bedroom door just so I, I'm sure that it's not gonna be under my bed when I get up in the middle of the night. It seems to be looking for its way back where it came from. But where on earth did it come from? It's not leaving. It's trying to find its tidy hole in my house plant. I guess I could just pick it up. I'm kind of a baby about that. Uh, I wasn't scared of snakes when I was a kid, but, you know, once I uh, turned 12 or so, I became psychologically disturbed and started having all kinds of snake nightmares. So, uh, now, uh, my inner fear of snakes has come out. When I was a kid, though, I would touch them and, and pick them up. I would still hold one if somebody gave it to me, but grabbing it freaks me out because I don't know what it's going to do. Oh god, my snake friend is back. It's quite startling when you go into the kitchen to get something and you see a snake crawling out of your stove. This time the, it's all pretty clean, so I don't know what he's looking for. No mice on the counter today. He or she. I need to figure out where this thing is coming in and seal it off because I am not comfortable with walking into the kitchen and seeing spontaneous snakes. It's coiled up right now underneath the burner. Can you imagine if I turned it on and it couldn't get out? Fried snake flesh? That would be so disgusting. Or if I just lifted up the kettle and noticed it there, I would freak out. I'm not sure if there's a potential path down into the stove because, uh, The mice can get through the burners and uh, somehow get away.
Yeah, it's going down underneath there. Somewhere. How incredibly creepy. Not in there.